Hey, welcome to Panuka Farm uh, YouTube channel once again. Uh, this is uh, yours truly, uh, Mr. Panuka, CEO and founder uh, of this little you know, farming enterprise called uh, you know, Panuka Farm. For those that are actual ardent, you know, uh, followers of Panuka Farm, um, you know, YouTube and uh, Facebook, um, you know, pages. Um, recently, we actually did uh, indicate that we're trying to actually migrate our production of sweet pepper um, and, and some slices of cucumbers into the shed net uh, to try and just improve uh, the efficacy, uh, the productivity of these, uh, uh, you know, crops. Uh, so I just want to show you uh, exactly what's happening uh, at the moment with one of the. Uh, you know, said next that we uh, recently uh, finalized. So on one section of this uh, 400 square you know, meter uh, shed net, uh, we have this slice uh, cucumber. Um, the variety is called Midas. Uh, this is the Rags one variety supplied to us by Holland Green Tech Zambia. Um, lovely, um, you know, uh, variety. Um, so this is just an area view. Uh, apparently, we actually used to, you know, uh, farm this uh, in the greenhouses, the slice of cucumber, midas, uh, but it was getting too excited. It got extremely very leafy, and so we had to downgrade it to the shed net, but uh, uh, it's actually doing quite well. Um, so that's your uh, slice of cucumber there. So given that uh, this is still a cucubit, um, in terms of disease management, same with the long cucumber, the English cucumber, and any other cucubits. So yes, Midas can actually do uh, in a shed net. So here we have some uh, sweet pepper. Apparently, actually, all these um, you know shed nets are designated uh, for the production of the uh, sweet pepper, especially the green one. Uh, so we have this crop here, and uh, it's so far coming up very well. Um, so I think once we actually remove the Midas, we'll actually be you know filling up with uh, some sweet pepper. Look at some of the fruits that have already uh, come up. So with sweet pepper, obviously the king fruit has to be removed to promote, you know, growth of the uh, plant. Um, so yeah, that's something that you've got to learn along the way in terms of just sweet pepper uh, management. But so far, looking beautiful, uh, loving how it's coming up. Um, so this is what you know a shed net can actually do, uh, improving. Uh, just the general outlook uh, of a crop and um, so far uh, I'm sure you can actually see that uh, there's a you know a, a good testimony that uh, already um, the general outlook of these uh, two crops the meters and um, the sweet pepper are actually looking very good so these are some of the pictures of the meters fruits uh, we're already actually picking um, so coming up very uh, well uh, that's just the general outlook um, area view uh, of this crop, dwarfy as it may look, but it's already in production. Um, so this section is the sweet pepper on drip and doing very well uh, thus far. So yeah, um, this is a very good testimony that uh, you probably can actually look at, um, you know, having shed nets as an alternative to greenhouses, which are actually quite expensive. Uh, yeah, so thank you so much. Have a lovely one. Bye-bye.